What's going on, y'all? It's JD Pakel. Today on CFE with JD, we're going to be breaking down the skill set of five star quarterback Dante Moore. Welcome in to CFB with JD. We got on the fairway there, Armstrong. People's Channel, everything you know, everything you love about college football happens here on a daily basis, nay, nearly daily basis. Would encourage you to subscribe. Armstrong Sims, Jet McKenzie, doing the real heavy lifting. You drive the show at my Twitter page, JD Pakel. Now, the 2023 quarterback class is just ridiculous. You got Arch Manning, you got Nico, you got Malachi Nelson, and you got Dante Moore. Dante Moore, fresh off an official visit to Notre Dame, guy's a five-star, going to be able to play virtually wherever he wants. Someone's going to get a baller in Mr. Moore. Sounds like the early smoke is going in Notre Dame. We'll watch this video in a few months and say, ah, you were right, ah, you were wrong. Nevertheless, we're going to break down his tape because he's going to make some program very happy and be a key ingredient to the college football playoff picture in the not-too-distant future. So Dante Moore... One of the things I love about him, he's so decisive with the football. The RPO scheme is something that you see a lot of, especially at the college game, a little more in the high school game right now as well. He's reading him. He's reading this grass with these three linebackers. So we have a slant right here. If there's space, meaning if these guys come up to play the run, we're going to throw it right past their ear. The tricky part with the RPO is if you have a quarterback who doesn't really know what he's looking at. He's kind of indecisive. He's not sure how to throw it there or not sure to give it there. You end up in an awkward middle ground. You'll run it when you're not supposed to run it. You'll throw it when you're not supposed to throw it. Go to the linebackers, go on the other way. You see where I'm going here? He has a really quick release. And so those are the two things that jump off the film. Quick release, decisive. And this play right here, especially. Cool. Linebackers are kind of patting their feet. That's fine. We see all this grass right here. Watch the way he just slings it, kind of like a shortstop. He just sort of takes it. Not really an over-the-top motion, but it's quick. It's efficient. It gets there in a hurry. Get there, ball. Nice. Give him room to run. Let your, let your athletes work. I love that by Dante Moore. Shows me he understands the offense. He understands the defenses. Understands the picture that he's looking at, which is going to be crucial for when he arrives at the next level. Now, we just talked about it. He's got big time arm talent. He's got that quick release. Also, he's got a really strong arm. He makes it look effortless. Right here, safeties are all the way over here. You can't really tell by the film, but we got a little bit of torrential downpour, so I'll draw it on there for you. Look at the flag. A lot of wind coming, so you gotta throw a tight spiral and you gotta have some authority when you deliver this football. One on one at the bottom of the screen. He's gonna be going deep. Watch what happens. Get off the release, perfect. Anticipates this safety coming over. If he hangs it too high in the air, he can come make a play. He can catch up to the football. Throws a dart outside shot. Again, safety can't get to it. Puts it past him. Puts his man in stride, beautiful. Anticipation, and again, the authority to throw the football on a dime to his man in stride. Big time throw, big time arm talent, Dante Moore. Another thing I love, his poise. He's got so much present in the pocket, he never looks like he's panicked. He's never looking like he doesn't know what's going on, running around with the chicken with his head cut off, gets pressure, no problem. Avoid the rush, get out, make a good throw. That's what we see him do right here. Get a little bit of leakage coming through, that's fine. Eyes are staying downfield, doesn't look like he's panicking too much, just makes a nice little move. He's so, so smooth in the pocket, boom. We're not, we're not looking like we're out of control. Staying within ourselves, eyes downfield. Now we got a guy right here. He's going to come up and try and knock our head off. We got a bunch of muddy pictures up here with our routes all over the place. Eyes downfield, deliver a nice easy strike to our man. Touchdown. Just makes it look easy. He's so under control all the time. He's got an easy release, easy movements about him. He's a fluid athlete. I love that about Dante Moore. Now right here, he's going to stand in the pocket and take a shot. Linebacker coming in your living room really quick. He's getting past that safety, and we got to hit our man right in this spot, which is a tough throw in itself, but when you got another grown man running at you in your living room, not a good feeling. Step in there and deliver a shot. I love that by Dante Moore right here. Look at this. Boom. Take a shot. Take a little hit right there. No problemo. By the way, it fit into a three- to four-yard window for me, Dante. Thanks so much. Thanks for playing. Goes back to his poise. He's never looking like he's overly concerned about what the defense is throwing at him. He's just taking it as it comes, takes what the defense gives him. You're going to hit me in the mouth. That's fine. Deliver a strike to my guy. Now, finally, we talked about it a little bit, but with that poise, dude's also a playmaker. Stuff breaks down. 
It's time to shake. Off of an awkward platform, Dante Moore is your guy. Same thing here, a little bit of leakage, still a high school offensive line, right here. He's gonna feel this, he's not gonna be overly compensating for it. Right here, a lot of quarterbacks take off, or they try and wheel out of it, or they try and do something crazy. Quick six inch movement, that's fine. Step up, just make him miss. Okay, we got some carnage right here. He's coming at us, no problem. Get out. Again, looking controlled. Right here, he could run and try and make up for this first down. He's got a lot of space, but I stay downfield. Feels this pressure coming right here, and he's gonna keep his eyes downfield and throw when he's not totally set. Sees his man all the way over here. That doesn't happen, this throw doesn't happen if he doesn't have the presence and he doesn't have the vision to keep looking downfield even with a lot of craziness going on around him. So Dante Moore, again, he's uncommitted. It feels like Notre Dame's leader in the clubhouse right now for the five-star, but whoever lands him is going to land a gamer, a quarterback who doesn't let the moment get too big for him, and a guy with all the physical tools that you would want in a young gunslinger. That's it for us here at CFP with JD. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Twitter, at JD Piquel. We are going to keep the party rolling. We will see y'all next time.